What's poppin' y'all? This your boy Bishop back for episode 24 of Shit That Be On My Mind. If you like what I be saying, hit that like button and that subscribe button. Tonight we're gonna talk about uh Oprah Winfrey. Uh she about to do a docu-series or documentary on Russell Simmons uh, sexual assault accusers. So if you see the pattern. She don't mind, you know, Michael Jackson. You know, anybody as a black man, she don't mind doing some type of story on them. Which, I would like to say, you know, uh, nobody's above anything. We all got good and bad in every group. So, amongst white people, black people, Arabs, Asians, Mexicans, it's good men, it's bad men, it's good women, it's bad women. You know what I mean? So, with that said, I'm not saying she wrong. For doing a docuseries because Russell could have done some shit. But what I'm saying is, why not make it even? Why not be fair? Why she can't do one on Harvey Weinstein? Why she can't do one on Jeffrey Epstein? Why she can't do no do one on Ed Buck? Like, why she always happen to choose black men? But never no white man like so. The, so if you had to look at it from Oprah's world or Gail's world, because that's her best friend who did the interview with R. Kelly, you know what I mean? Shit like that. If you look at it from their world or their point of view, everybody else is straight and doesn't do anything wrong other than black men. So that leads me to believe that they got a personal issue with black men and what I mean by personal issue like father brother cousin somebody most likely father you know where they got a already a bad seed planted in their mind and, 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 and rightfully so they, dad could have molested them or did something wrong to them or anything where they got a different warped view towards black men than how they feel about white men or any other men you know so for her to make a docu-series about Russell, I'm like, damn, you can't make one about no white person? Like, like the people I just named, you can't make one about them? Gail, you can't, like, interview none of them? You know what I mean? So it just, it just, it's, it's like, they being used, because they're emotional issue. Whatever issue they got with black men, they got a, they got a real issue with black men. So the, the, the dominant society of white supremacy is using them as a vehicle, you know, and what I mean by that is, it's like basically, instead of them putting on blackface, instead of um, a white man putting on blackface or a white woman putting on blackface and talking about black issues and, and shit like that, you know, at the end of the day, they're using Gail and Oprah, you know what I mean, so they basically black, but in blackface, you know, so at the end of the day, man, that's just, it, it just, to me, it's not fair at all it's just not fair at all that she can't balance that out she too smart and her resources are too long not to you know what i mean uh do matter of fact i didn't see some with jeffrey epstein's accusers has been speaking out why she ain't going to them and say hold up let me get your take on your story about jeffrey epstein you know what i mean why not so like i said man i just think she filed for that she's not wrong but she's filed and she's being exposed, you know, to our generation and a generation that's under me, you know, because I'm 42, you know what I mean? So the generation that's under me seeing it and then the generation under that is, is, is starting to see like, oh, okay, Oprah is portraying to be this way and this, that, and the third, but hold up. She always shitting on black men. So I'm going to keep it real short and sweet tonight, man, but just pay attention to Oprah, y'all. You know what I mean? Like... Fuck all the money. Fuck all the prestige and all that shit and who she linked with and all that. Just peep how she always do shit to play or downplay a black man, but never to a white man. There's something to be said about that and there's something to be seen about that. So y'all have a good night and I'll holler at y'all. Peace.